Hey guys, this is Amy Lee 33 and welcome to another episode inside Amy Lee's Land of Love. I'm just going to bounce around on the camera just for a second. It's so much fun. I cannot even bouncy, 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 bouncy. Loves it so much. That's enough bouncing for today, Amy, my dear. Anyway, let's start the episode as we always do and say hello to my family. I can see Bert hanging out over there. Let's go see Bert and see what he's up to. He seems to be gazing outside the window today. Bert! Hi, Bert! Hi, it's me! Oh, oh no, Bert, look at me, look at me. Don't be shy. He's getting a little bit nervous again with the whole YouTube thing. He's like, I think I look really ugly. Bert, you would never look ugly, darling. You're such a handsome chap and everyone on YouTube knows it. Don't you worry, Bert. You're lovely. Anyway, where's Bertha hanging out at too? Do you reckon she's downstairs somewhere? She could be in the museum, the block museum room, or she could be in her bedroom. Let's go check her bedroom. They're not usually in their bedroom, though. It's kind of worrying. I think I need to put more, like, things in here that Bert likes to look at and like you know try and draw them in here a little bit more and um, I can see mischief has been in here though mittens I can tell you're mischief anywhere but anyway Bertha let's find Bertha it's a Bertha mission today Bert have you seen Bertha I think she could be in the block museum that's my guess today Bertha oh she is as well oh Bertha Bertha it's me it's Amy hi Bertha how are you your eyes are looking beautiful today your nose is just terrific remember look down your nose sweetie I'm not in the far distance I'm literally right next to you Bertha look down your nose Bertha! She's like, I can hear you, Amy. I just cannot see you. It's because your nose is so gigantic. There we go. Now you're seeing me. Ah, she's so beautiful. Look at her. Isn't she just marvellous? Can you even on the Bertha? Let's go see the doggies and the kitty cats too and choose one or two of them to take with us on today's adventure. Um, oh, sorry, Bert. After you, sir. After you, sir. There you go, sir. After you, sir. Have a good day, sir. Good day. Good day, sir. Good day. Uh, yes, yeah, so let's go do that. And, of course, we'll say a big hello to the snow golems, too. Hello, doggies. Hi. Hello, kitty cats and doggies. Ah, You're all looking wonderful. Lola, have you calmed down since the last episode? You were a little bit cray-cray. It was totally adorable. Little Romeo is bouncing around on the bed there. What's up with you today, Romeo? Look at you. You're bouncy, bouncy. Everyone's in a bouncy mood. I love it. Anyway. Who would like their breakfast this morning? Who's got their head in the wall? Can I see it this side? Can I not see any snout? I like it when I see some ears and a snout in random places. It's fun. Who is that? Hello? Doggy? Who? Who is it? I reckon... Is it... Uh... Boomer? Boomer, is that you? It is Boomer, you silly goose. Friend. Anyway, I'm sure the kitty cats would like their breakfast. So there you go, little Saturn. And calm it over there. And who would love their beautiful breakfast? Baked potato, anybody? No, of course not. They don't want baked potato. They want steak or flowers. Steak or fishy. No, everyone wants steak. Look at Romeo bouncing around up there. Loves it so much. Cannot quite even. Anyway, Lola. There you go, my little gooseberry. We have Maximus over there. We have Luna. Did you get some, Luna? Did you get some? We have Sailor Dog. We have Boomer. We have Romeo. We have little Mars over here. And we have Lexi. Now, who should I take with me? You know what? I think I'm going to take Comet. Because Comet hasn't been with me on an adventure yet. So, Comet, come along, Comet. And I need to take a doggy. And I think we had Lola in the last one. We recently had... Uh, Luna and we, we, I, I think I'm going to go for a Boomer. I'll tell you what, Boomer, you can come with me today, sir. Actually, I, I, why is there a chicken in the chest? What even with the chicken? I don't even know. Come along, Boomer. Come along. You can come with us today. Let's go check out Mittens and Mr. Frost and Blizzard and see how they're hanging out at today. Mittens. Mittens. Hello, children. How are you all doing today? You're looking wonderful. Hello, Mittens. Are you loving life? Hello, Mittens. Full of mischief. I'm glad that witch hasn't got you again. And hello, Mr. Frost and Blizzard in the corner there. Loves it so much. Cannot even. The cuteness is so real. We do have a lot to do in this episode, though, children. We need to carry on with our doggy park. So that is what we're going to do today. My goodness, it's night time already. We should sleep. It's just been morning apparently we need to sleep so come along come along come it you can come with me we're gonna go sleep in the garden of peace and love once we've said a big morning hello to grandfather oak you're looking so spiffing isn't he looking grand and marvelous and such like gentleman like loves it isn't he the cutest little thing come it don't you just love him i love him muchly cannot evens on the muchly of the cuteness of grandfather oak anyway We'll go to the cute red, red patch and see which cutie we have added this week. It could be 
I know who it is, they're very cute, cannot even on the cuteness. Uh, but yeah, we better do that quick because the googlies are going to be coming any second now, gang. So we better really quickly go down and check out this cute recruit. And uh, the cutie I'm adding this week is... Dion! I'm adding Dion because Dion was so amazingly talented and she sent me this amazing picture of my new pony Lily and you can see the picture at the very end of this video. Thank you so much Dion, I love the picture, welcome to the cute recruit patch, I love you very much Lee. I'm destroying everything today, Amy, what is with your behaviour? I need to go to the garden of peace and love and have a little nap, say hello to peace week and mellow out because I'm in a destroying mood, I don't even understand life right now. Um, so yeah, there's a creeper. The googlies are coming, children. The googlies are coming. So we are going to sleep and start the day in the morning. Hello, peace pig. You're looking so peaceful. I feel already zenful. I love zen. And hello to peace chicken too. Right, so let's sleep up here. Sleepy, sleepy. Good night, peace pig, peace chicken. My little boomer dog and my little cat. Okay, so we are now in the morning. So what I think we need to do now is come along. Oh, look at them running, aren't they? The cutest set of things. Can you even... We need to get some supplies. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, comment. I kind of like shot you in the face a little bit there. What is with the creeper crew? Hello, Sarah. Me, Katniss. Boo! Good job, Comet! Good job! Look at him run away! Look at his little legulus! Aha! Going! Oh no, look! There's spiders over there! Spiders! They work for the witch. They are spies of the witch. Come here, little creepy. Come and say hello to Katniss. What are you doing in the barn? Why are they all hanging out in the barn? It's like a creeper club up there! What even? Back away! Back away! I need to get this one. Can I get him at the top there? I kind of want to go up there and see what the trouble is all about, but I really don't want my pets to be hurt. So, Boomer, sit down there for one second. I'm a little comet. You sit down there, because I don't want you to get hurt. If, that, if they blow up and you're in there, I'm going to, like, cry and everything. Um, <laughs> hello, <laughs> Tinkerbell, what even? Right, so what is going on up here? We need to be careful. Ah, what? That's maybe where the I hear Emily 33 Club is. That's probably where they're all having the little club. I need to go up there and sort them all out. Okay, right. Spider. Actually, he's not going to hurt me, is he? Oh, no, he really is. Back away, sir. Back away. Naughtiness is real. Ah, creepy. There's another creeper as well. Ah, ah, why is there the creepers? I do not even understand why you're all hanging up out here it's a conspiracy there's something going on i think there's like a, a secret door or something that leads to the i hate emily 33 fan club where all the spiders and the witches and the creepers all go and join and talk about how much they hate love and and hate me and stuff it's it's bad but anyway We've taken care of that creepy little business. So we do need to run back to the house real quick and just gather some supplies because we need some leaves and we also need some like stuff to make some stuff. I want to make some dispensers. I'm trying to remember what I need. I'm a little bit confuddled, you see, children. I'm a little bit confuddled. But I need to make some dispensers. So to make dispensers, I'm going to need some string, cobblestone and redstone and stuff like that to make the bow and whatever. I know what I need. It's all in my noggin. I, I can figure it out. But I do need some oak leaves like so. Uh, we will need some cobble, which is here. And we need some string, which should be up in here. And some redstone, which is around here somewhere. Well, there we go. Got some redstone. Loves it. I think we also need to get like a bit of meat. Because the meat is going to go in the dispensers for the doggies at the doggy park. Love, 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 love. So I should have a plenty load of meat in one of these chests. Uh, okay, there we go. There we've got the chicken. We've got the cooked pork chop steak and the raw beef. Love, it, I do. Right, so now what we're going to do is we are going to go down to our doggy park and I'm going to show you guys what I've been doing off camera because I kind of like built it up you can see it in the distance there it looks just like the garden of peace and love so we're getting there children we are getting there it's almost getting done we just need to add like the like tree detail like you can see up there like that on the peace garden that's what we're going to add to the doggy park just to make it look like a lot of natural stuff like trees and stuff like that you know are you all with me children ah oh, I love it I need to have some lunch actually because I'm walking so slowly let me just munch out love 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 Love, 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 love. There we go. Perfect. That will do. That will do. So what we're going to do is just grab a few leaves like so. And we're just going to go around and just add some sporadically like so. There we go. Just to make it look a little bit natural. Um, doesn't have to be completely covered or perfect because like I said in the last episode, trees aren't perfect. And that is why I love them. They're just like, they're trees. You can't tell a tree what to do, right? Trees are just treeing and they're happy treeing and that's it. 
See what I mean? So we need to do that all the way around. But I'm not going to bore you entirely and do the whole episode by doing this because, you know, it'd be dreadfully boring. And you guys would be like, Amy, seriously, 20 minutes if you're doing this? I know. I wouldn't do that to you, children. I care too much about your feelings to do that to you. I just want to show you what I'm going to be doing. So we're going to do, like, probably another spider we're just gonna do like a little bit here a little bit there you know and yeah and then i'll finish it probably off camera why would you go there i don't even want it there there we go loves it loves it can't even on the loves it there we go uh awesome we could probably add some vines or something as well just to give it like another like natural look or something uh right so if we put that there and there 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 uh, a bit more here there we go loves it loves it loves it so it's looking pretty cool let me show you the effect Ah, uh, it looks pretty cool. I think Comet agrees that it's looking quite spiffing. Um, so that is awesome. So the next thing I really want to do is go in here and... Ah, doesn't it look lovely? I want to make some dispensers. So I need some white wool because I'm going to do something real funky. Let me just put down my crafting table like so and then put down my furnace. I don't have any coal. What even with the shower coal? We're going to have to use like wood or something uh so we're just gonna smell a couple of like cobblestones just so i can get some buttons but in the meantime we're going to make a bow and arrow thingamajiggy to make a bow and arrow thingamajiggy um i can't even remember the recipe that's a fishing line right so a bow is uh let me just figure it out in my noggin isn't it like uh like this or something and then the string is like <laughs> How do you make a bow? I've totally forgotten life. Is it like that? No, of course it's not like that. How do you make a bow, children? I've totally forgotten. It's been so long. I've not needed to make a bow since I've had Katniss in my life. Because Katniss is so wonderful. Uh, okay, let's go for... Clearly this is not working out, so bear with me, children. I'm going to have to have a little research because I've forgotten. That's how much of a noob... I'm being at this current time so bear with me in the meantime enjoy this nice picture of a turtle isn't he a pretty turtle do you love the turtle the turtle is pretty cute can't even on the turtle cuteness look at how happy he is with life and also admire this nice picture of an onion look how round this onion is look how perfect the onion is the onion is life. Anyway, I've just figured out how to make the bow. Well, I didn't figure it out. I cheated and I've looked on a website <laughs> because I couldn't. I can't even remember. So we can go ahead and make it um, like this. So ooh, I was so close to being right. I cannot even. It's just, it, 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 I, yeah, I can't even. I'm so sorry of my newbiness. Look at that. There's a bow. Seriously, Amy, how could you not even know that? Okay, so we're going to go ahead and make another one. It's because this bit wasn't equal. And it's like, it was warping my mind. It's not how I pictured a bow because these sticks didn't look equal. But it's okay. It's okay, children. It, it, it's it's going to be okay. Right, so we've got that sorted. And the next thing we need to do is we have our... Well, <laughs> really? Really? That didn't take that much stonage? Okay, we do need to get some wood. So we're going to take some of this wood. We're just going to make some charcoal, I believe. We're going to do that. Or just, you know, put the whole lot in there. Can we do that? No, okay. Let's just make some charcoal. Just because it'll be easier to make some charcoal. So while that is doing that, we are going to make a... What do you call it? A uh, dispenser. To make a dispenser, we are going to do it like this. Uh, we're going to have some redstone here. And there is a dropper, which is not quite a dispenser. So if we do that, it should turn into a dispenser. It's pretty much the same kind of thing. If you notice, it looks so similar that you can hear that. Uh, so we're going to make a few of these. I think I'm going to need four for now. Comet is going crazy in the background. Can you see him? He's going madness. He's mad, I tell you. So we've got two there. Uh, we've got some charcoal so we can smell a few more just to make some buttons. Um, so we do need to get a bit more, like, stickles just so we can make a few more bows, like... What am I even doing with life? Seriously, stop it. I'm just going too confuddled. Right, so now we can make the bow like this and this and this. Why? How could I not figure this out before? That is just embarrassing. It's been a long day, children. That's the excuse I'm going to give you. It's been a very long day. A very long day. And why would I ever need to make a bow again? I have Katniss. I have my baby Katniss. And Katniss is the bestest bow ever. Look at her. Look at her glowing. Pew, pew. Love set. Anyway, so we now have our four like arrow thingy so we can go ahead and make another dispenser or two and then we'll have four of those so if we go one two three one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. like so 
and we're going to put two thingies there and then one here that's another dispenser and one more dispenser right so we have our dispensers so now what i really want to do is go and knock some wood out over here there's a chicken again that was lola's friend lola made a friend who is a chicken right so then we're going to knock out i think one two three four of these and then i'm going to put one here one here one here and one here and then i'm going to fill these with various meat so this one can have the raw beef and then this one can have like some cooked porky chop and then this one can have chicken and then this one can have a steaky steak like so and then what we're going to do is i'm going to add this white wool around this little bit up here and i'm going to go around at this la 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 like that see and then i'm going to put this bit here <gasps> And this bit here, and this bit here. Not there, silly. Anyway, seriously. Uh, one, two, three. What? Wait, wait. This is not where I wanted to be. I got a bit carried away. I want it like this. There we go. It's because I couldn't add it there. I know what I'm thinking in my noggin, children. It's okay. Don't fear. I'm not quite crazy yet. So one, two, three, four. And then we're going to have that there and that there. So then it's going to kind of look like a boon. Look at it. Ah. Oh. Doesn't that look pretty cool? And then we're going to add some little buttons. So then we can just like, it'll be like a vending machine quite almost. And I thought it'd be a really cool idea. Um, so let's put some stone here. One, two, three, four. Love set. And then, excuse me. There we go. Love set. So let's go and add these buttons. And then we'll have a really cool little machine where the doggies can get some snackies. And when we press the button, it's going to throw out some snackies for the doggies. Isn't that cute? Ah, so that's like the first addition to our little doggy park. This could take some time making this whole doggy park. I didn't even know how long it's going to take, but it's going to be real fun. I'm really glad that we're doing it. What I am going to do is add... Excuse me, sir. Thank you, Boomer. You get him, Boomer. Go on, Boomer. <gasps> Don't you have my Boomer. Don't you even. Are you okay, Boomer? Do you need some food? Here's a chicken. Have a chicken. There you go. Would you like more chicken? There you go, chicken. Loves it. We're going to add like a little bone up here too, and then it'll be like a proper little doggy park like so. There we go. Love, love love oh that, that's so totally wrong let's go up here love love there we go ah so now it's a proper little doggy park doesn't that look wonderful so then what i need to do off camera is do the boring stuff and fill this all up with some like leaves and stuff to make it look like a big tree so i'm gonna do that so by the next episode the only things that we get to do for the next episode is the fun stuff and fill this whole doggy park with fun stuff for the doggies to do so if any of you have any cool ideas on what you'd like to see in here put them down in the comments below i'm gonna build like a little dog house like a a traditional like little doggy house and maybe like a little slide and a little pond or river or something that they can play in if you guys have any ideas please let me know and put them in the comments but other than that thank you so much for watching guys big thank you to dion for the amazing amazing picture check it out at the very end of this video in a few seconds if you like this video then please give it a big thumbs up comment and subscribe i love you guys so much lee i cannot even bye guys